Cardio Muscle Blast. Right now, we're doing the health bounce for two minutes just to warm up our body. Feet are hip width apart, shoulders set back and away from our ears. Core is nice, solid and tight. My name is Angie, Angie Fitness TV. You're gonna notice I have a high step bench with my eight pound weights right here. So I can easily grab my weights and it's on a higher surface. Every minute, we're gonna switch exercises. Some, we're gonna use our hand weights and some we're not. All right, we have one more minute. Deep breath in. We're just in our house bounce, you guys. One more time, deep breath in. And a nice exhale. We're just saying, we're just waking up our body. Now, don't roll onto the outside of your foot. Don't roll onto the inside of your foot. Evenly distribute the weight between your right and left leg. Don't roll back on your heels too much or too far forward on your toes. Nice, neutral, and even. All right, let's start to wipe off the sweat off our forehead. We're in that health bounce. Our feet are not coming off the rebounder. We're getting our body acclimated to the bounce. Anytime you need active recovery, come back into this health bounce. Make sure you're following the guidelines I set forth. Chest tall and proud, shoulders back, core engaged, head popped out of the turtle shell. Evenly distribute the weight between your right and left leg and you're landing nice and neutral. Wear those supportive shoes, wear grippy socks. It's up to you and let's bounce, feet off the ground. Continue to wipe the sweat off. Now, if you feel the arm movement is too much, along with the leg movement, you can put your hands on your hips. If you feel taking your feet off the rebounder is too much, you're gonna stay in that health bounce. All right, now circle both arms. Again, I don't care how quick, I don't care how slow. I don't care if you bounce and your feet come off or if you just wanna stay in a health bounce. Your workout, 15 minutes start to finish. Super basic. Super simple, beginner friendly. What makes it beginner friendly is I show options and you pick your option that works best for you, right? Yes, Angie. Woo! All right. Come into the health bounce, everyone. Pick up your hand weights. So you see how simple that is? Let's get in that bicep curl. Feet hip width apart. I have eight pounds in my hands. Now I can go heavier because I'm not bouncing and lifting that weight at the same time. This is rebounder cardio, muscle blast, core, nice, solid, tight. Each exercise is 60 seconds. We're working muscle endurance. Anytime you pick up those weights, you're working bone health, hormone health, you're increasing that metabolism long after the workout is done. Evenly distribute the weight between both feet. Don't roll your feet out. Don't roll them in. Core nice, solid, tight. Shoulders set back and away from your ears. Last time, right here. So see how simple that is? Out and in. Now, options. If the out and in is too much for you, do so many on the right leg and so many on the left leg. Out and in without bouncing. Now, if you can, you can give me those jacks using those arms. Now, if the arm and leg movement is too much, right here. If the single bounce is too much, come out here and then come in for so many. Come out for so many, come in for so many, right? Many options, many variations. Your body, your workout. Focus on what you can do. Don't worry about the rest. Health bounce right here. 
Ooh. Pick up one weight right here. Now let's just row one arm back, down. So we're in a pulling motion right here, working the muscles of our back. What's your front foot doing? You're not rolling out on it, are you? No. So it's very nice when you have your weights right by you. You don't have to bend down and pick them up off the floor. So make sure you have something so you can quickly grab that weight right here. 15 minutes goes by really quick. You can use that heavy weight. Now, if you needed to, if you had a stability bar, look how I put my hand on here for support. You can do that just as well. Four, three, put the one weight down, bounce here, bounce. All right, good job. All right, let's start some side to side, small movement right here. You can have your hands on your hips or arms up. Now, let me show a modification. For those that can do this, keep doing this. If that's too much, I'm leaning side to side right here. I'm not bouncing. My feet are not coming off the ground. I'm coming up on my toes. So you're starting to learn or look right here. That's another good option for you, right? Your choice. The more you do this workout, the stronger you get. Consistency is key. Coming back day after day, getting that workout in, right? Woo! -hoo. Come to the center. Little bounce. Use the arms. Wait, other side. Right here. Again, your hand can be on the stability bar. Your hand can be on the front of your thigh. Up to you, working that back muscle, rhomboids, latissimus dorsi, shoulders melted away from your ears. Wow, you guys, class goes by really quick. Woo. Now I only pick up that heavier weight when I'm not bouncing. I would never bounce with heavy weight. That's just a recipe for injury and disaster. So don't ever pick up heavy weight and try to bounce at the same time. You can use the rebounder as an unsteady surface, but don't bounce while you're lifting heavy weight. Four and three, put the weight away and bounce. Always come into the center and bounce. All right, let's get that one hip forward, other hip forward. You're just rotating one hip forward, other hip forward. Now let me show an option. You don't like bouncing. Hip, turn, hip. So you're taking that right foot forward and you're taking that left foot forward. You're taking that right foot forward and left foot forward. Another variation. You want more because you're ready. You're twisting. Your hands are touching. Opposite hand, opposite shoulder. How about that? Your call, so you're taking the right hip and the left hip in the front. Man, you guys have so many modifications. You can pick and choose. This workout gets to be as simple, as super basic, or as super hard as you want. Up to you. Ah, come on, four, three, two, one. Bounce in the center. Then take your feet off. Grab both weights right here. Hammer curl, lift, hammer curl, down. Hammer curl, lift, row, row, row. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Hammer curl overhead, hammer curl up, hammer curl down. Hammer curl up, two more, two more. Feet hip width apart. You better notice your body mechanics, you guys. Woo! Four rows, here we go. Four, three. Oh, we have time for four more. Here we go. Four, three, two. 
put the weights up. Look how simple and nice and clean that is. We get back, back in that bounce, very safe. I bought my high step at Walmart. Okay, let's see. Right here, arms can come up and down. Okay, if you're at this level, stay here. Let me show modification. Just tap back. If you've been with me for a while, you know that, or put your hands on your bar. Focus on just to tap back. Hands can always be on this stabilizing bar, right? Yeah. Woo! Nice workout. Notice your feet when you land. You're not rolling on the outside, inside. Not too much on your heel. Not too much on your toes. Your feet are on a railroad track. Evenly distribute the weight in the right left leg. Come center bounce. Take it down. Feeling good? Grab your weights. It makes it so simple. All right, your feet are a little more than hip width apart. Sit down in a chair. Rebounder cardio, muscle blast. Now for this exercise, wiggle your toes. Sit back in your heels. Yeah, I want you to sit back in your heels for this exercise. Trying to get that glute activation. Really get that hamstring activation. I have eight pounds in my hands. Woo! When you sit back in your heels, really engages the calf, glutes, and those hamstrings. Oh yeah, who can't use the little butt lifting? I know we all can, right? Core nice, solid, tight. Shoulders set back away from your ears. Put the weight up. Look how simple that is. You can get right back into balance, <laughs> bouncing, and it's really safe. Whew. Now, what we're gonna do from here is heels. Now, you can do one arm, other arm. Now, give me those heels right here. Let me show you, low impact right here. Opposite arm, always take the bounce out. Now, you can always, right here, hands on your hips, right? Or, you want more, you're gonna give it to me. Oh yeah, boom. Oh. Let's go. Looking good. Bounce in the center. We're gonna do push-ups on our frame. We can do it. We're gonna come down, our knees are on the rebounder, hands are on the frame. We're gonna go down and up. Ready, go. Down, up. Down, hands are on the frame. Shoulders back down and away. Keep it going. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Quick break. Come back. Eight more, you guys. And then we're gonna come up. Here we go. Eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, and come up. Right here, health bounce, health bounce. Time to cool it down, feet hip width apart, health bounce. Interlace your fingers, chest expansion. Focus on the down stroke. Soft bend in your knees, hips, knees, ankles, toes, pointing forward, right here. And that nice health bounce. Deep breath in. Inhale. Oh, and a nice exhale. One more time. 15 minutes flies by, you guys. Big inhale. And a nice exhale. Woo. Take your hands up. Stop the health bounce. Reach over to the right. Reach over to the left. One more time, reach over to the right, reach over to the left, hands down, deep breath in, inhale, 
and exhale. Thank you for rebounding with me today. I have a leaps and rebounds rebounder. It is bungee style, highly affordable. Look in the description box below if you would like to buy one, 10% off. Have a beautiful day. Angie, Angie Fitness TV.